What's good, Homer Squad? It's your boy, Homer Ziggy, and we back here with another reaction. So, here's the thing with this now. Now, if y'all, if y'all, it's like a blast from the, well, not saying a blast from the past. Double XL freshman freeze, well, the Double XL freshman freestyle came out and such, and each of them were coming out and such, and I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I wanted to react to them but let's face it it's one thing to do the freestyles and such and even if I wanted to do them separately or all together at once eh, it's not gonna it's not gonna tell how I feel about them so I figured I waited until when the cyphers came out so this one we got well I guess you could say this is like part one of the cyphers and such but you never know they they gonna list out who comes out so with this cypher we have Fitness two times, finesse two times, Lola Brook, Friday, and Real Boston Richie. Now, look, just off of the, now, I have heard of Friday. I've seen his name a lot, but let's face it, this is like straight up with y'all. First time I'm hearing all four of these names. Well, in a way, I've heard Friday. Like I said, I've seen the name Friday a lot. And I've also seen the name Fit Finesse two times, so but I've never heard like how they actually sound and such when it comes to music wise. So this is actually gonna be my first time hearing all four of them. So either way, we about to check this cipher out. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my socials up there. And without further ado, let's get in the video. Alright, so we got Yo, finesse. Yeah, you wanna come out here? Finesse two times. Two hundred over fifty in these pockets, four pockets full. Gotta say I'm gangsta, check my records, it's understood. Gotta say I'm marked, twist my fingers in every state. Gamble with your life, I got whatever. I six and eight. Tell them four, this rapping shit don't work. Then I'ma send a hoe, won't tell them more. Two types of exotic, told them send them both. Be on the floor, off from Memphis, R.I.P. the Billy Bo. Wrestling with my freedom, now I got shit in the bigger four. Tapping out, hold up, stop the beat, homie. I'm and I gotta say, shout out to Pierre Born for the beat and such. Now look, it's basically like this. With the way how Double XL has been over the past two years, because let's face it, the last time people was like interested, interested in much in Double XL was like what, 2019 or so, 2020. So. Nine times out of ten, people like shuts off, cause, cause in a way, Double XL has always been like that exciting factor to see like new artists coming up and such, new artists that you may see and such, or you see they're getting the rec recognition and such. So, over the past number of years, Double XL was quite a uh, fest and such. So, let's see how this class is gonna be. To check my records, it's understood. Gotta say I'm marked, twist my fingers in every state. Gamble with your life, I got whatever. I six and eight, ten or four. This rapping shit don't work, then I'ma send a hoe. Won't tell them more. Two types of exotic, told them send them both. Be on the floor. I'm from Memphis, R.I.P. the Billy Bo. Wrestling with my freedom, now I got shit in the bigger four. Tapping out, hold up, stop the beat, homie. I'm backing out, secured out on feet, glocking my hand. When I'm backing out, who cracking out? This what happened every time they count me out. Free the guys, I'm eating. So for finesse two times, he definitely his voice is unique. I ain't gonna lie. So and he had it and he sounds like he can really rap good and such. But it's basically like this. This is like a cipher. So nine times out of ten, I don't really see if like you can actually like. Cause I get it. Like with ciphers, they always see if you can like rap and such. But to me, I feel like if you were done it on like certain songs of your own. Then I would want to see if you can actually like have fire music, bars and all. So it did good on this, but yeah, maybe I would have to check out some of their old, some of their like songs before this. But either way, this is like my first like listening to them, so I wanted to catch how they sound and such. So. Okay, so real Boston. Rich. I can't make no moves without my brother. Niggas hating on the boys. Say they rich. 
bitch out bubble. I'm on some roster shit. Fuck your dad and fuck your mother. I'm trying to fuck on this little sister. Lie, like say I love her. I told you I was gonna get you back. That's a triple double. Always been a freaky jet. Trying to fuck my cousin under the cover. Sliding in the must ain't half a brick. I'm ducking under cover. You know I've been having shit. I ain't never been no fucker on her. Little bitch bad is making good, but Boston probably still won't fuck her. She know I'm different. No switches with me. Up in traffic. One thing I do gotta say though, when it comes to a cipher, you gotta have energy. Cause I don't know why. Cause let's face it, in, in any time when you've always seen like the ciphers and such, right? You always see everybody in the background before they about to come up, get lit and such to it. Even off somebody who's doing their verse and such, you always see people getting lit. Lit and such. Now, I don't know why they're just rocking back and forth. What is, what is that? Why, like... Put some excitement into it, man. Good, but Boston probably still won't fuck her. She know I'm different. Don't switch us with me. Up in traffic. Got to move statistics. I'm always saying, but I don't rock when niggas ain't politicking. How the fuck they sell a gang on cut? Throw a nigga I ain't friendly. Man, I'm trying to get in that splash. Who I heard that shit was sipping. I don't want relations. I'm just trying to fuck to be specific. I can pull up in this. Snatch the bitch that's in a Bentley. Killers in a bed. Fuck the ops and whoever come with them. Okay, so here's the thing now. Here's my thing now. When you coming in to singing on a cipher, nine times out of ten, that shit ain't gonna land. Cause, well, let me fix y'all. Cause when you come on a cipher and such of any kind, you're supposed to be like rapping. You gotta come with some bars and so and such. So. If you come in to sing, nine times out of ten, it would work. But sometimes, but most or majority of the time, it don't. So we'll see how he, we'll see how he does this. They wasn't with me back when I was driving in my old three. I okay. was sitting on that bench, they wouldn't play me. Now I'm up on niggas like I'm KD. Hey, now I just shoot, shoot. Hey, I can't pass that rock, I got a hoop, hoop. She love when I pull up in that brand new coupe. I don't know what thing she wouldn't do for me. She sound. He, she, she. he sounds like a. He sounds like Caribbean. He has like a. I can hear like a little Caribbean in him. Like, I don't. I don't want to say it's like Haitian. But he has like a Caribbean vibe. I don't know why. The way how he sounds, he has like a Caribbean vibe. Y'all let me know, cause. I know they say U.S., but come on now, the culture. I always look at this. I know every. I know it says U.S. and all for certain people, but sometimes when they talk, when certain people talk, or whenever they're doing music or whatnot, you hear it like a type of culture in their voice, whether it's like a Jamaican culture or a Haitian culture, like Guyana, Guyanese or whatever, and such. You hear it in the voice. You can hear it in the voice. So. In a way, how he sounds, I don't know. It's either mixed between Haitian or Nigerian. In a way, it, it gives me that vibe. Shoo, shoo. Hey, I can't pass that rock, I got a hoo hoo. Hey, she love when I pull up in that brand new coupe. I don't know what thing she wouldn't do for me. I don't know what thing she wouldn't do for me. Hey, I don't know what thing she wouldn't do for me. Now I've seen her name go around a bunch and such on Instagram and on Instagram and such. So if y'all need to tell me if she gonna wash y'all, if if she wash is she, it's basically like this. If she comes in with more energy on this song, on this cipher, than the rest of y'all niggas, that already proves my point about certain things. But let's see what happens. They can't get in without no wristbands Gang members is my big fan Claim my season every shot Killing no more killer cam I don't know man Stop asking me all them dumb questions Hit us going dumb questions Live with it Tr Why in the world this is echoey? Hold up Why in the world her verse is so echoey? 
it's like everybody else was like good and synchronized and such why is hers the only one that like sounds like it's in an empty room what the heck they can't get in without no wristbands gang members is my big fan claim my season every shot killing no more killing cam i don't know man stop back give me all them dumb questions it is going dumb questions live with it trigger finger on hold till my feelings get this that pretty set here I come good good go i do the pick and now get chose get top then he get low if you ever have problem niggas hollows what i fuck good been back i'm every niggas match what the hold the freak up now why the hell she all right let me say it like this why she sound like she has the most energy out of all these three niggas Cause all the other three Nick, one was coming in, the two was coming in like on some saucy shit. One was singing and such, but in a way, it wasn't much energy towards it. It wasn't like something like vibing out and such. Why she sounds like she had the most energy out of all these three niggas? Cause I, it's not me trying to hate on all three on the other three guys and such, but I'm just saying. But on the other hand, why she sounds like speaking? She sounds like somebody. I don't know what. Yeah, this that pretty set. Here I come, good, good, go. I do the pick and now get chose, get top, then he get low. If you ever have problem, niggas hollows. What I fuck good. Been she got. To, she has to be from New York. She had. From, where my phone? Ah, oh, nah, look. She gotta be from New York. Let me search it up. I don't care. I'm doing... The way how she sounds, she's that deep. Nah, hold up. Where's she from? Yep, New York. I was right. From actually back for... It don't matter what... The point is, she from New York. Because she... That is... That was... That voice... I be wondering why is it that when it comes to the females in New York, why the hell y'all sound so rough? Normally I just think it'd be the men on such, but why the freak is the woman now? What the hell? I don't know. But she sounds. She sounds. She sounds like she could be Pop Smoke's sister. Straight up. This that pretty set. Here I come. Good, good, go. I do the pick and now get chose, get top. Then he get low if you ever have. Honestly, I don't know what to say. Like, why the beats? It's basically like this. The beat was all right and all, but it didn't have like enough energy or so. Like, why the beat sounds so dead? Why did everybody else sound it so dead on this? Like, there was, like, no energy. Like, what the? You see why? Now you see why XXL has lost their certain touch and such. Because, like I say, 
look, it's no hate on the other, it's no hate on the rappers and such, but I'm just saying, like, why is it that when, I don't know, but y'all, y'all let me know who y'all thought did good on it, so, if, cause if I had to see, from my first listen, right, if I had to see who was, like, really believable as much, not to say all of them wasn't, but to me, to who I feel like who were more, who was most believable, I would have to go with Lola Brooke because at least she was giving more of like a she was trying to like give her some energy as wise and such but all in all I don't know why everybody was going with that slow flow and such because I get it the beat was going slow but at least and it's like this they don't was like switching up no flows or anything so I'm like bruh switch the flow up or something Y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. And let me know what you let me know who you thought was more, who was fire and such. But either way, hopefully for the next cipher that comes out and such, let's see if that one has more energy. Cause I don't know. But y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. It's been your boy Homo Ziggy signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. Man, this cipher was too I don't know. Lego.